Ling, funnel strat for Team Philippines, for Team Perpetual GMA. All right, Butters, let's go in the uh, in, inside the game. Team, real boss in the blue side and Perpetual GMA on the red side. Real boss having a lot of firepower here. Especially in the early stages of the game, mm -hmm. they have the ability to uh, actually invade this blue take coming in I'm... from uh, Team Philippines. I am not surprised that Real Boss is planning to go in and try to steal that Violet buff from the Ling because Ling is very Violet buff de dependent. Yes. So if you think about it, it's going to be, you know, uh, a big shot in the head here for the side yeah. of um, the Philippines if they do get that. But this is very tricky. This is risky on the side of Malaysia because if they don't get it and they give a kill to the side here of the Philippines, then that yeah. might be enough. Not really enough, but that might put Ling into the path of the snowball. Yeah, yeah. That might put uh, the Ling in a dominant, uh, dominant uh, path. Especially one way to counter uh, the Ling is to just shut him down in the first five minutes of the game. Just don't let him roam around. Don't let him get the buffs that he wants. And uh, yeah, this is a, uh, actually a risky play for Team Malaysia as we are uh, still waiting for the game to start again. We're just having a little bit of technical pause, but still I'm excited to see. There you go. They actually went for the clear. Uh, and they're, they're not gonna go for it. Yeah, they're, they're not, not gonna, gonna go, gonna go for, for uh, the invade. Just playing it safe. And uh, butters, I guess that this is going to be the grok off lane for uh, Team Real Box. Yeah, man. The, it has the scaling potential that it has. You know, just realizing that Perpetual GME here doesn't really have that much control if they don't get to level four first. Yep. This is the opening here for the side of real boss. I mean, in in terms of level 1 or level 1 to 3 potential, I'm seeing Perpetual GMA having a bit of a problem here in real boss just dominating that. Real boss needs to use that window. Yeah, they really need to. They really need to. They have a lot of uh, damage here coming in from the Grok and the High Loss. Now, uh, both of the teams just uh, playing... Uh, Playing very patient in the first two minutes, just giving all of their carries the buffs that they need. Meanwhile, Aji Josh is your Esmeralda against this Grok. Still, nothing's happening, but I'm I'm guessing that around four minutes we're gonna have, or three minutes we're gonna have the first turtle take. So that will actually dictate what's going to happen in this game, Butters. There you go. And, and Ling's just oh. gonna go in. Ling is gonna go for the steal and he actually gets it. And right now, Kufra <laughs> is going for that charge, that flex, Tempest of Blades in the middle of everything here. And they're yeah. gonna go for that high loss, high loss almost going down. And this might be the snowball that Ling is trying oh. to find. He goes in and takes a lot of damage. Wow. No kills. Okay. Okay. That was risky from my Lumaker, uh, maker. He has a lot of energy and it's not it's not lacking no energy gap yeah, no energy no energy gap from uh, milo maker but uh if you're gonna think about it butters they still lack the damage to take out the two tanks from team real boss plus that was a three on four fight against uh perpetual gma so still uh, we are now witnessing the power of this lineup that you cannot really kill the high loss and the grok immediately um, and they, yeah. they have control, like they yeah. really have control of that fight. And Hylos almost going down, good thing that he's innately tanky. If it was another hero like uh, Valir or the carry, that could have been that could have been two kills straight. And since they didn't really get the, you know, the kill that they were trying to get, they couldn't really dive because they have all the stunts in the world. And if they get caught out, and right now oh. going in Atlas, wow, look at that connection. Kufra into the Atlas, oh and no oh, zero kills. Will actually probably go down. Yes, he will. Tempest of Blades in the middle of everything. And oh, right my. now, Kufra will go down. The Philippines here falling down. Like, you know, just uh, rocks. Like I don't know. Bridge. Something in between. Falling. I don't know. I'm just going to call it as I see it. And Manjin, <laughs> Philippines. They make it a 3 for 3 
Yeah, but uh, man, like what you've said, speaking of stunts, that is the high loss initiation uh, on that on that uh, octopus uh, being summoned by Zero Kids. The Atlas uh, being not uh, not really careful on that first skill. Again, this is uh, yeah. Team Real Boss having the upper hand in terms of counter engaging because they have a searing torrent, they have a wild charge plus. The glorious pathway, and sometimes, sometimes the fist crack can act out as a shield, as a zoning shield for Team Real Boss. So I think Team Perper uh, Perpetual Gem A Butters really needs to uh, get the right timing in entering and picking up, uh, in picking off someone. Yeah, and Manji, looking at the gold right now for both teams, I don't really think that it's favoring oh. Malaysia. Tempest of Blades. Catching out that Valer. Valer here will go down. Kufra trying to go in. Get yeah. a bit of a, you know, control onto that carry. But carry here is just a uh, way off the target. You know, Gene. You know, Manjin. Yes. The idea here for Philippines is to just keep on forcing the team fights. Yeah. And they Thanks. really yeah. want to get the team fights. They really want to get the ball rolling here. And Malaysia, they are really just, you know, they, they're just passive. They don't yep. want to fight. They know the fighting capability right now of the Philippines and they know that they scale better. Yeah, I think uh, the Philippines, uh, our, uh, Team Philippines is better in controlling the tempo of this game. Actually, uh, Persian Teco needs to be careful in positioning himself. Again, this is Ailing. Uh, yes, he has the Purify there, but again, you still have the Jawhead. To, to worry about so man team perpetual gma is uh, looking strong in the first stages of the mm -hmm. game mm -hmm. um, even though team real boss has a lot of disengaged uh, uh, capabilities team perpetual gma can actually burst one down quickly just like this just like what we saw yeah. and there you go another kill for team perpetual oh. gma plus is this another pick up no but that is oh. the out from the jawhead kill from the philippines the girl's pathway is actually not going to be enough to save the lives of real boss as team philippines will the national pride so you have to carry that that is a lot that is a big responsibility on your side not just your country but your company as well <laughs> <laughs> We're carrying the name of Real Me Malaysia and Real Me Philippines too. Shout out to our bosses, of course, and uh, the I mean, I mean, of, uh, I mean if, of, if Real Me Malaysia and Real Me Philippines has uh, like a convention or something or a meeting, they can actually brag about that. Oh, my country beat your country. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is this is. They're actually fighting for bragging rights, right? <laughs> right. They're, at, they're fighting for bragging rights. Okay, we're now back to the game. Here we go. That is the Ling entering with the swords. There you go. Swords are revealing light to the carry. And the carry will fall down. Who's next? It's going to be the Brock. Guys, double kill from Milo Maker. The energy has no gap. And they're yeah, picking the off one. Team Real Boss one by one. Baby oh. bouncing ball from the Kufra as well. And there you have it, four heroes. Gone. Hylos is just way too tanky, but you know, if you don't have the backup just to bail you out, you are gonna get a lot of damage, and that is going to be enough to kill you. Turtle yeah. right now, look at this view. A very yeah. nice uh, view from our uh, director. From our, yeah, from our uh, director. For production, from production, the production team. is uh, very yeah. paid. Yeah. From our one-man production team, right? One-man production team? Yeah. It's a uh, Shinbu events team. Shinbu events team is real. There you go. There's going to be another team fight here on the sidelines on the jungle side. That is a stun for the Kufra. There you go. Time to engage! Plus the Atlas Ultimate for heroes. Actually make the two heroes. They will get the stun, but the Ling is just too deep here. But he will actually survive as team philippines are now losing heroes nice counter engage for the balier and man they're running for their lives zero kills surviving this one but team real boss they got the upper hand team philippines were just too uh too deep 
and engaging in the bottom side. That's why Team Real Boss will now convert this to a tower take. Good split decision making there from the side of Team Real Boss, Team Malaysia. They realized that Esmeralda wasn't there, and if they take take out Ling, they uh, Team Philippines won't have any more damage output. So yes. they just go straight for that, and they try to fight Badang here, getting caught out. Even oh. with the ultimate, he cannot take down anyone. Yeah. And he Absolutely. will just, you know, get picked off. He yeah. tried to steal that orange buff, but to no avail. Yeah. Uh, I mean, right now, Ling is just... Ling is unstoppable, if you think about it. And if Ling doesn't make those um, moves that will get him caught into the back lines, I don't yeah. think that they can kill him. That's the only reason why Badang caught him, is yeah. because he just went straight for the carry. Yeah, uh, I like your point. Uh, I think that's why uh, that's a good, uh, good, uh, good technique for uh, Team Real Boss to uh, reserve all their stuns, or uh, just reserve all their counter engaging uh, <laughs> skills. Just reserve it to the link, right? You have the fist crack from the badang. You have the fireballs from uh, the yeah. balir. Just wait for the link to land, but there you go. That's another landing from the oh, link. Oh. The carry will survive the random step and the normal hit with the bouncing ball. Can it hit? No, it won't. Oh. The Balir just clearing out the house, cleaning the house, ladies and gentlemen. But meanwhile, another ejector coming in from the jawhead. Here comes Badang. Here comes the guy. But, okay. That's a zoom in from our camera, Desmeralda. The third person view, third person yeah, view. The third person view is just too real. In the films, ladies and gentlemen, it's 12-12. Team Real Boss coming back from uh, from a huge deficit in the early game, getting another team fight win. I mean, Ling being very impatient here. If you think about it, he doesn't really need to go in just to force out or to take down the carry immediately. You can just wait for the Atlas or the Kufra to catch him out. Wait for the Purify probably and just you yeah. know take him take him down if it, if it gets to the point that carry can't really move anymore. Yeah. But he keeps on forcing and those forced engages on the carry is giving him giving this carry a lot of gold because. Harry has the bounty hunter talent up on it on her side. Yep, yep. I think uh, Butters, uh, Milo Maker. Uh, there's a saying here right now in the Philippines that going out is prohibited. So yes. again, you really need to comply. Uh, when I say comply, you really need to be patient. And going in just like this, there you go, another one, charge counter, go! Ling with the ultimate, the glorious pathway is not enough to help the carry. And plus, he is at the top of the world. He is now targeting the Valir. The Valir will kill the Atlas, but Ling, he complied. And now going out is now allowed. Ling, Milo Maker, just slicing and dicing through, real to the, mm -hmm. through the real boss's team. And it's another win for the Philippines, and that's what that's how you do it. That, that's how no you, uh, that's how you do it. If you're the lane, you just really need to uh, enter at the right time. Yes, uh, Philippines here won that fight. They didn't do it clean. They got the carry in the middle of the fight. But if you think about it, Manjin. This is what happened. This is the effect of what happened through Milo Maker's Asar moves mm -hmm. in the early, in the earlier parts of the game. I think. <laughs> Sorry, moves. I think, okay, so yeah. I think our director is in, Butters, I think our director is what, what, enjoying the, the camera angles. You know. Yes. This is the yeah. this is the drone view. Yeah. This is the, the drone view. There you go. Give us I the think... give us that third person view. Yeah, there you go. There, it is. <laughs> there you go. That's it. That's it. The next level oh. production value, right there, guys. The only, Shinbu events team. Yeah, only in the RGL. Only in only the at RGL. Me. Only at Real Me. But again, then again, guys. Kidding aside, I think Team Real Boss is not yet out of this game, right? Mm -hmm. uh, I yes. think what they they need to do is just. Uh, stay beside, uh, just stay beside the carry, right? Yeah. Just don't leave the carry behind. Just 
Uh, I just I want the high loss and the grok just to to support him out. Wait for the link to enter and reserve the wild charge or probably stun. Uh, heroes coming in. But again, there you go. There you have it. This crack from the Badang. Oh no! Team! Uh, real boss, they're divided. Divided with stand. United! You, I don't know. United, United Nations! What are the United next? Nations! Team, Team <laughs> Philippines! They, <laughs> they took care of the problem. <laughs> and man. They won another team fight, 15 to 18. I, I think what you were trying to say is United we stand divided before. Yes, <laughs> but I forgot, the lyrics. I forgot the lyrics. I forgot the lyrics of the oh, song. You forgot the lyrics. It's fine, it's fine. It's fine, it's, it's fine. fine. United Nations, United Nations. <laughs> but yeah, it made sense, right? It makes sense, it makes they sense, unite, 100%. They will stand and they will stand, divide, yes. they will fall. That's what I'm trying to say. But again, oh, okay. Ang okay. uh, thinking place. Perpetual but... GMA. Perpetual yeah. GMA got lord. Yeah. Okay. So uh, Philippines now butters on the verge to victory. Uh, what can yes. you say? I mean, uh, team. Uh, we uh, we all thought that Team Malaysia, Team Real Boss, actually has the upper hand. But man, uh, Team Philippines, they actually got this link going. Hmm. But. The thing about Philippines is they're not really picking the best of fights for their side. So we might need to look out for Malaysia here if they're gonna come back from that. If they keep abusing the fact that Ling isn't picking the right fights or the right pick off, uh, you know, right pick off uh, positions, it might cost them the game. And uh, yeah. right now they do have the Lord, but I don't think that the Lord is a problem for the side of um, Team Malaysia just because number one, they have the carry. And number two, they have the Badang. So yeah. those are really fast Lord, uh, Lord takes or Lord, Lord um, you know what? what Lord what's kills. The proper term. Lord, Lord kills. killers. Lord killers. There. Yeah. So yeah, I mean, they're just gonna have a, a good time, you know, just dealing with these people, and yeah. it's I all it all comes down to it all comes down to Kufra and the Atlas on how they will take the fight and give the fight to the link. I think what you're trying to say is the Philippines, they need to be patient and lessen the sour moves just like this. There you go. That is a kill from yep. Rebel Near and the Grok. And right now, Team Real Boss, they're coming back from this game. Is comeback real? Yes, it is. Because three heroes will die from Team Philippines. They're virtual DMA. They're running for their lives. But look at this. Look at this, Milo Maker making something out of this push. There you go, a split push from the Ling. The Kufra will sacrifice himself. They're oh, now at ding, the base. Ding. I'm looking at the base in a third-person perspective. Milo Maker making his way oh, out, oh, oh, but oh. here comes the revenge. Fire. That is the revenge kill. Valir ball the from Milo, Milo Maker. Okay, okay. So, I like the you know, I like the decision making coming here from the side of Malaysia. Stop laughing when you. <laughs> <laughs> I like the idea coming here from um, uh, the side of Team Malaysia because they pick their fights. They don't fight in an open area. They try to control the link in a way that they can reach him. And he doesn't have that, uh, you know, enough options to go for the walls. Because if he gets enough access to walls, there is literally no chance for you to catch the leg. And that is one of the hero's uh, prowess. So, yeah. what they do is they stick to those narrow spaces and they just fight there. Because they know that if they catch Ling with a stun, Kari can shred through the Ling and he wouldn't really care about it. Yep. Like, it's going to be a breeze. Yeah. Man, uh, I think uh, what we're, we're, we're trying to say in this game that it's clear that the Ling, uh, Milo mm -hmm. Maker, is the protagonist because he's the one getting fu funneled. But if we're going to look at Malaysia, uh, I think uh, the player right now is really doing well yeah. is uh, Valir, right? Yeah. Is the Valir. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not really sure what his name says. Yeah, but uh, I'm gonna read that later. But man, uh, 
he, re he really uses this Valir so good uh, with the clutch clearing torrents just to pick off heroes. I think um, the 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 Badang really ne really needs to reserve that fist crack, right? Because again, mm -hmm. uh, the Ling is a, a squishy hero, right? Just bait mm -hmm. out the the Steel Tempest and then you're okay, right? Mm. So, man, still it's uh, for me. Uh, Team Real Boss, they're not out yet, you know, because yeah. yeah. there's a tendency here in the Philippines uh, that they might do some sour mm. moves, right? Yeah. Sour moves. <laughs> we call it sour, sour moves. moves when you really you enter and you overextend, and 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 you and uh, you disposition yourself yeah. in in the game. Technically, you are in a position where you you shouldn't be. Like yeah. you don't have any business there, so why are you there? And you just get picked off just because you're you were alone. So, looking at the gold here for the side of um you know uh team Malaysia and team Philippines, there is a, a bit of an illusion here because if you look at it, it's 54k versus 41k. Mm -hmm. That 54k is actually on the Esmeralda and on the Ling. Mm -hmm. yeah. All the all the gold is funneled through them. But for the side here of Malaysia, that 41k is actually divided to the Badang and to the carry. So that means they technically have two carries on their side. Yeah. So if, I mean, right now, the point of Esmeralda is not to take down the enemy heroes fast. What, Eridmi, what the Esmeralda wants is to just extend the game. Just yeah. have that, uh, you know, extended team fight and just win from there. So if they take out Ling, that means the advantage is gonna go to the side here of Real Boss. So that is when Real Boss, the lineup, it really shines. Yeah, they just need to pick off the core heroes. Ooh. But I think they're the ones getting picking up uh, picked off. Uh, Butters, there you go. Close line from hell from the Grok, but it won't do anything. As uh, man, that is another warning shot from Team Philippines. Uh, but dang, almost dying. 1920, man. I mean, what? Uh, if you're Team Malaysia, what can you do right now? Just hug the base. You have the capability to fight, and you have the capability. It's a pin post, though. I think. Yeah. yeah Probably I'm just there I'm just is. But, I'm just but it's going you. to be a pin comment. And just look for the pin comment. Don't look for the pin post. <laughs> okay. So, what's the what's your uh, take? On what's happening right now, Manjin. I mean, I think this is look. Think, this looks like it's a. This look. This looks like it's a fifty-fifty. I think it's seventy-thirty, man. For, okay. Uh, Who's seventy? Philippines, because again, oh. they, they they shut it down the carry. He has no da damage as uh as of the moment yet. Plus, uh, they can now take the Lord actually, so they can push one lane. Uh, and actually, Milo Maker can uh, just uh, take the Lord with uh, with ease, you know, with someone else, you know. And uh, man, I think, um, man, I think Team Team Malaysia, they're just waiting for Team Philippines to make this huge mistake, like uh, like yeah, uh, going in deep and overextending. But I'm guessing well, that Team Philippines they figured that out, and right now. Uh, they will act. They're now actually yeah. stalking the Lloyd. I don't know, man, but Ling, they're not invading, not stealing the orange buff of the carry. They are letting real boss breathe. And if you're a team, you're leading, and you have all the turrets down, or almost what? all of the turrets down on the other side, you wouldn't really want that. But yeah, on oh, no. the other side of the fight, a lot of flickers getting used. Doris Pathway Ooh. is there, godlike here from Ling. It will take down that Valir, and this is the fight that probably Team Malaysia or Team Philippines is looking for. This might go both ways. And look at oh! this, look at that ultimate coming out from the Badang. Badang here doing the work. Oh Man, my goodness, that, was, that was just so nice from Hang Tua. That, that is the perfect ultimate that can come out from him. But I think his punches are not enough. <laughs> To kill all five heroes for Team Philippines, I uh, we all thought that it was over. But I think if we're going to see more plays like that for Hang Tua, from Hang Tua, I mean, I think they have a huge opportunity to come back.
from this game. I think he's the deal breaker uh, for uh, for Team uh, Malaysia. He really needs to step up and just yeah. land all those fist cracks perfectly, just like that. I mean, who knows? We might, you know, uh, get the longest game ever. We, we might tie up or we might break the longest game ever in uh, in the other league. So let's see. Let's see. This yeah. is looking like a very interesting fight. It's all about execution. It's all about skill right now. And Kufra is forced to back off. <laughs> there you go. There you go. This is the reason why uh, I like the lineup of Team uh, Real Boss. Because again, uh, they have damage and they have a lot of control. And let's see. Because Team Philippines, I, I really think that they, they, they need to initiate the Lord right now. You know, just just scare off Team Real Boss by, uh, by getting the Lord. But as I say this, there you go. Another entry from oh. Mr. Milo Maker. But oh no, that is Badang with a beautiful S crack to Aji Josh. Aji Josh will survive this. But again, that is the threat that you get from Team Real Boss if you do some sour moves like that. Man, Butters. Are we looking at another long game? Are we looking at another 30 minute plus game? We probably are because both teams are being passive. I mean, Philippines just went on the aggressive there, but I don't really think that was the right play on their side. I'm just calling this as I see it because they could have gone for the Lord. They do not have their immortality, immortality charges up. It wasn't a safe fight to take. But for the side here of... Uh, a real boss they didn't go straight for the lord yeah when they pushed back the other team they didn't go straight for the lord they could have set up their domain inside that area of the lord and they could have take that uh they could have took that fast because they oh. had to carry on their side Looking up setting up that is another huge setup from the cupra ling with the ultimate as well targeting the carry but the best crack is there to lock him down as the Grok will just back off Ling resetting Milo Maker trying his best to go up top and to make a play but the carry three hitting the Atlas the Atlas is down for a minute and team Malaysia team real boss they are now holding on the door holding the line and making a huge defensive move 20 to 21 Man, that was actually a nice initiation from the Kufra, but I think this is the problem with the Philippines' lineup, Butters. Their damage is now expiring. Okay, so Ling here trying to get in Tempest of Blades in the middle. They're trying Ooh. to take down the carry, but Ling will go down, and this might be the turn around. Look at Badang in the middle of nowhere. He's not even close to the fight, but what are you doing? But his team is winning, actually. His team is winning. And yes. they get wiped out. They got wiped out. Did, 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 oh, did no. they just drop the ball? What just happened here, Manji? Who's the real boss? Who's the, the real, real boss? The real me. The real yeah. me is the real boss. The real me is the real boss. So, so as Hang Tua. Because, man. He wasn't even there. He wasn't <laughs> even there. <laughs> winning the team he, fight when you're not even there. Real boss. <laughs> He's the real boss, right? Plus, it's in their name. The comeback is Ooh. real. They got the Luminous Lord and Hang Tua it's going a, a robot, on the run with it's the Atlas. It's a robot and a human being fighting. Let's go. One on one. One on one with the Great One. Oh, no, 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 no. We're not just yet, gonna, not just gonna yet. go back. Just gonna go not back. Not yet. Not yet. But they got the Lord. But what, what, is, what happened? The, but what happened, man? Uh, Milo Maker. Entering, targeting the carry, but uh, I think the high loss and the grok was just too tanky. And <laughs> you know what happened? What happened? Lord, Lord took down grok, and they <laughs> can't make the most out of this lord. I'm 100 percent sure that this is gonna go down once it reaches the tier three turret on the side Let's of uh, Team Philippines, and that is going to be another. Uh, that's going to be another extended stall for this game. But let's see here. Actually, they're joining this lane, uh, this Lord lane. 
Let's see if they uh, they can actually protect it. There you go, the Lord charging in with a spear. Oh. Atlas with the three man up up, but actually that is the purifier coming in with the carry. Tempest of blades from the lane to counter initiate, but another beautiful fist crack from the Badang, and they will kill off three heroes from the Philippines. Team Malaysia, the Silos is on a roll, on a rampage with that second skill. Link Four heroes falling down. The comeback is just too real from Real Boss, the realest of the real, hashtag real me, and the game goes to Team Malaysia. Patience wow. is a virtue, Manjin. Real Boss.